everybody welcome back to the channel i'm super happy you're joining me today we are going back here in the summerlin las vegas and this is the community of lenar here in the heritage at stone bridge before we proceed i would love to uh, shout out to one of my buyers here in the summerlin las vegas area they are belinda and raymond and they have a sand Cody so thank you so much for choosing me as your agent they are in the process of looking for homes here in the beautiful summer in Las Vegas um, it's quite windy today that's why you can see that the video is moving a little bit but we're gonna feature this home it has a next jet it has uh, three bedrooms and three bathrooms they have an av available move-in but I can't access the move-in right now because the agent is no longer here but um, I was requested for, uh, by one of my buyers to tour this home and also um, there are also other homes here that are in the 480,000 or less than 500,000 there are quick move-ins as well this community is for those that are 55 and older and they have a very nice community center here where there is a swimming pool lots of things to do so I can't wait for us to tour this together guys and if you want to, me to tour the other homes on this community that are quick move-ins just comment down below or uh, contact me on the information don't forget to subscribe down below like this video and also don't forget to share this video to your family and friends that might be looking for homes here in the Summerlin area that has a gated community and a really nice center for the residents okay it's it's shaking because it's a little bit windy here right now but I'm super excited guys also if you missed some of my videos just check out the channel page there is a playlist there so there's a lot of quick move-ins here guys at Lenar so let me know if you want me to visit any of these quick move-ins that are available here so that we can make it happen for you if you'd like to move in the beautiful summer in Las Vegas. Let's do this. Let's tour this home together. This is the home and there's a bunch of different model homes here. I've toured these homes already in the past but my videos at that time was really shaky because I wasn't using a DJI um, sta stabilizer during that time but also during that time this uh, center here wasn't here before but take a look at this guys they have a lot of things that you can do here it's a 10,000 square feet clubhouse they have a fitness um, room they have outdoor pool and spa and pickle pickleball courts I don't even know what it's what's that but yeah um, this is the center that one and if you want uh, if you wanted me to request to feature that center I can ask the uh, agent here if they would allow me to uh, film their uh, center so let me know and comment down below so that we will know what you will get on this community this is a gated community 
and we're here in Heritage by Stonebridge but I wanted to feature this because a lot of my contacts wanted to see a next gen so I'm gonna feature this this is Everly right they have a quick move in for this one and then they have a bunch of other quick move-ins also that have a lower price that are below 500,000 so um, this one is quite big this is 2,873 square feet right really nice stone work there this is the it's quite cold that's why my voice is kind of shaking yeah I don't understand why the weather suddenly dropped today so this is Everly before you even uh, go into your uh, house you have this two car garage with that one car garage there so total of three car garage and this is a very modern design guys this is this is quite modern because of the clean lines right and this is the view there's a lot of mountain views here so i found out that some of this 55 plus community you they actually allow your uh, sons and daughters to be living with you as long as they are of uh, age right meaning there is a certain age limit as far as the other builders i think it was uh, 19 years old but i have to check this one because i didn't know that uh, i was touring this today it was just requested from me so i wanted to be able to research more about what uh, age limit or meaning what minimum age is required for the sons and daughters to be living with the people that are buying here okay so before entering the house you have this nice stonework with this beautiful gate there it's like a double security right really nice to have this is already gated but you you still have a gate in your house that's perfect i believe this is the area of the next gen that side i visited this like eight months ago i but my video was shaking a lot because i didn't use a dji but now we're using a dji so it's much stabilized okay so you have a mini courtyard here and then there is a separate entrance for your next gen okay so on the left side is the next gen and the main door is this one this is really nice stonework here and this is kind of like very spacious you can actually hang out here right during the night okay let's enter this house double doors really nice again there is a quick move in here guys for a bunch of different um, uh, homes there are quick move-ins even below 500,000 and those are even negotiable but not on this plan though because this plan is quite expensive but there are some that are below 500,000 quick moving for other model for other floor plans okay I visited this already before so I'm not gonna be wowed right it's already familiar to me I think I remember this one is kind of like your hangout area but you know for drinking especially if you like to drink what are they offering us here what kind of drinks could this be comment down below guys but if we ever have to go to the bar or drink at home I will probably have mojito is my favorite I actually like rum also but it depends upon which country does the ram uh, came so I only have uh, specific brands that I like okay so this is a nice um, a nice uh, hangout area compadre compa padrino and every uh, friends that you have all right your padrino and your visita or visitors okay really nice Ooh, i remember my father he used to be watching hollywood uh, 
people before is actually familiar with Elvis Presley. I don't know if Elvis Presley is here. I don't think so. Yeah, these are, I don't know them, but oh, this is a nice one. Look at this guy. It's very um, antique. Okay, so this is like a hanging air hanging out area because you, you can definitely make this like a bar area if you want or you can make this as in your as your office you can put like glass doors here glass doors there and you have an office at home okay let's check out the left the right area first because there's so much to see here guys this might take a while as well okay in this area you have a laundry very sp spacious here that's your two-car garage, right? Let's see if we can open it. I don't think so. They usually close this because they store some items there. Okay, so you have a laundry area. Now, I just wanted to mention while we were walking, um, Lenar has this trademark of everything's included, which means that Sometimes the, the only upgrade you'll have to do are the flooring and the backsplash and the thickness of the countertops. But all the structural items that you see here are included in the base price. Hello guys. So for example, this one seems standard to me. And then you have a Let's see here. This seems standard too. So you have a full bathroom here, right? Oh, okay. You have an office here. But I think this is convertible to a bedroom. And the reason why is because you have the standard closet there. Okay, so it looks to me that you can convert this into a bedroom and then you that bedroom can use this fat bathroom okay so so far we've seen one bedroom and then one full bathroom before we go to the next gen there we're going to visit first your main living area but before that there's something here okay so you have a coat closet All right this is a heavy door I was just surprised how heavy it is. That means the quality is good. Let me just close the um, the door here, guys, because I want to make sure the door is closed. Okay, I close the door, and it seems darker in here because it's already evening. See how it's the the uh, what do you call this? The backyard is already evening. Okay, so this is your. This is very spacious guys it doesn't justify in my video because sometimes the video shows a little bit odd of uh, angle but imagine there's still some space here right it's a wide space so yeah this is your living room area they they have no fireplace here but you can definitely make this your own like have a fireplace there shelving and then you can put like different uh, LED lighting on your cabinetry because you have a space here. It's large, so you can make this happen. Okay, I don't know if you can enter at the back before it goes dark. Let's see, right? Yeah, they don't allow. So it's, but this is, this is a very small one, guys. The backyard. I don't know if you can still see it, but very small. You cannot put a swimming pool there. But certainly, if you like a larger lot, we can take a look what uh, lots are still available for this floor plan. Okay. They don't allow us to go out, even though there is no swimming pool. I remember Lennar doesn't allow. Yeah, it's closed. See how I can't even open it. Okay. So, but this is your cover patio structural. It's included in the base price. And there are quick movements. Okay, so we are in your dining area. Comment down below, guys. Do you like darker floors or you like lighter floors? Because it's a mixed 
uh, preference. You know, some people like darker floors. Some oh, look at this, guys. There's a bunch of like some people. Was it? You know, I don't know what happened here, but there's love. There's something that went uh, broken. Okay, so this is uh, how it looks like when you're at your dining area, very open. And then those doors usually are already included. You don't have to upgrade them because when I was talking to the agent here, they told me that usually the upgrades made are just the flooring, the, um, the thickness of the counter, and then the backsplash. So basically, they have this uh, trademark of everything's included and mainly those are the structurals also and the counters the, and the cabinetry are already included. So you don't have to upgrade the type of cabinetry. You just have to change the color if you don't like the darker color cabinetry. Okay, in this regard, they have um, this really nice, um, this is monogram, right? Dishwasher. And it comes with this filtration system, so you don't have to worry about drinking bad water. And also it comes with this. And this is how it looks like when you're at your dining, sorry, when you are at your uh, center island. A really nice center island. For some reason, a lot of these model homes have this kind of grain. I don't understand. Maybe because it, a lot of people likes this, right? Which is nice. It's, it looks nice. And then you have this golden nub. Instead of the red nub, you will get a golden nub. Isn't it nice? You have a golden nub. Ooh, they don't have a vent hood. But it's okay. This looks fancy. Okay. Yeah, look at this, guys. This looks fancy to me. Okay. But you have a stove there. This looks nice too. Very nice. Ooh, you have a, a really nice um, refrigerator. You have a dispenser here for water. It's not the biggest, right? But uh, at least it's included already. Okay, so the backsplash is not, right? That's what I was told, right? Um, and, but we'll have to verify once we see the details of what were included. But as far as I was informed verbally, they said that usually the thickness of the counter, the uh, some of the call, uh, qual colors of the cabinets may change in terms of pricing, the backsplash and the floor. But the structural and appliances usually are, are included. Okay, so far so good. It's very open. Yeah, this one. This one is most likely 7.5 feet or more than that. Okay, oh, we forgot to check your pantry here. Yeah, so you have a pantry there. I forgot to check the, uh, sorry guys, I'm gonna check if it's cl soft closing. Yes, it is. Perfecto. Okay. So, yeah, this is your open floor plan. And then that is the one we, see, we saw a while ago where you can entertain your amigas and amigo. Amigas and amigos. Okay, so I think we're entering. You know, I forgot. I don't know, even know what we're entering now because there's so many... There's one here and there's another one here. I believe this might be the primary, but we're gonna check. Okay, you have another coat closet here. Do you really need the two coat closet, <laughs> right? I wonder why, but to me, you know, you can maximize this space here, right? Have the door here, because it looks to me that they have two coat closet. We already saw one and there's another one here. Okay, it's quite dark in here because it's already evening. I was just requested by one of my buyers to feature this home because they needed a uh, next gen. Oh, nice. This is amazing. Really nice flooring. 
Okay, so this is your uh, one sink here. Look, guys. Yeah, very spacious. And then that's the other one. This looks like it's included in the price, the counter, because uh, they told me that those are, y y normally it's the thickness that's upgraded, but this thickness seems to me it's included in the price, even this one. Hello guys. Okay, so that is your water closet. This is very standard, nothing really special here when it comes to uh, this shower. Plus, also, that is included because it's, they told me verbally that anything you see as structural are included in the base price and all quick movements. Okay, and really nice, very spacious um, uh, walk, uh, walk in closet for the primary bedroom. Okay, let's go to your primary bedroom here it's quite uh, dark already because it's already evening you know what they pre-wired it for chandelier or electric fan right ceiling fan because i don't see a or maybe these are pen um recessed lighting pre-wired no these are smoke detector or fire sorry fire sprinkler those ones so this is the only electrical. Those are fire sprinklers. Okay. Okay, so again, this the nice thing about this is you have an access to the backyard, right? So from the bedroom, it's see how they don't allow people to go out. Okay, so this is your spacious um, primary bedroom. Let's go to the casita, which is somewhere here, I remember. Okay, so we're entering the casita. And you can close this door if you want privacy from you, the people that are staying in our casita. It's quite dark in here. Yeah, that's the, the thing about it is you needed to upgrade a lot of recessed lighting here, right? And this is the door going out. This is the private door we saw a while ago, right? So if you remember, this is the courtyard and that's the entrance to the main door. Okay, oops, sorry about the noise. Why is it not closing? Let me just close the door, guys. This is weird. It is hard to... Okay, so yeah, I close it. It's quite hard to close that. I don't understand why. There must be a problem on the door. Okay, so this is your casita. So your casita will have this kitchen. It doesn't have a stove because it's not allowed to have a stove for um, certain regulations, right? It's a going to be a different permit so but they don't get those permit here they don't allow most likely to have a multi-family permit for this community but you'll get your refrigerator and the um, microwave so that your guests can uh, heat their food right and then they have this living room area dining area and then the tv there it's quite dark in here because uh, it's already evening, guys. So I apologize if this will result in a very darker uh, setting when you watch this video. Okay, so we're entering your, look guys, full bathroom, very standard. This is for your um, casita or next gen. So Lenar has this next gen trademark also. They don't use the word casita anymore because they have a trademark of next gen. This is a nice one. This is a very spacious one guys for the next gen. Very standard closet. So yeah, so this, this casita is big. And then this is the um, 
Let me open the door. At the door, the lights. Let's see what's this. So, okay, nice. I forgot that they have the separate uh, laundry area for your next gen. So basically your next gen is able to live comfortably. And then they can also park the, the their car here, right? Because this is the one car garage we saw a while ago that is separated from the two car garage. And then when your guest or in-laws enter the this next gen, they'll be able to enter like this, right? They can get to their bedroom quickly or if they want, they can get to their restroom quickly or they can watch TV here. So this is very ideal, guys, if you have uh, parents or in-laws that is no longer able to go upstairs and you want them to have a very comfortable private space, then this is for them. Very, very, uh, because they also have access from this side, aside from the door from the garage, right? So very nice setting. I think that's very ideal if your uh, parents, in-laws, guests can park and go inside the next gen without entering the main living area. We're back to the main living area. Okay, so that's why this is only considered a three bedroom because that's the primary bedroom we saw a while ago. And then there's another one there, right? I don't know if you still remember, guys. Are you still with me? There is another one here, which is a secondary bedroom staged as an office. Yeah, this one, staged as an office. So that's the, th the second bedroom. And then the third is the casita. That's why it's only three bedrooms. Okay, guys, um, I think we've toured everything here. Please comment down below what do you think of this home? And really love to uh, see your feedback about the pricing as well. They have quick move-ins right now. And if you're not looking for a bigger house, there are quick move-ins that are below 500000 Still negotiable. So uh, when you see the price, don't be surprised because you're not going to pay that full price. They're very open to negotiation. Builders nowadays are even offering buy down of rates, closing costs. It's a bunch of different promotions. We just have to be careful about knowing what are the um, qualifications to get those incentives so that we can dig into whether or not you'll qualify. Okay, thank you so much guys. This channel is growing so fast because of your continued support really appreciate your help on this channel and uh, I love reading comments I enjoyed it if, you know even though you just say hi hello I feel very happy that someone is watching and uh, paying attention to what I'm saying or maybe like com even if you're commenting really bad it, it doesn't hurt my feelings because I learned from those and I you know, take everything as an improvement for the channel. So if you wanted to say anything, anything, you know, just feel free to everything that you write is not going to be hurting me at all. I'm not that kind of person. I'm more of like open to things, improvements, because at the end of the day, I wanted for us to be able to have a really nice channel in the future. Okay, thank you so much guys and have an amazing day today.